doing so many great things, man. Um, so let's just jump uh, into Remember the Titans. Is it true you were a 30-year-old guy playing a high school kid? I, I sure moment? was. You know, black don't crack, bro. <laughs> Stop playing. Now I got my little Russ. You know, we call these grays Russ. <laughs> I got me it. and you, we got a few yeah, of these. But I'm with you. I'm, I'm, I'm with you. Yeah, I can't keep just for men in business. So. I, <laughs> you're, your thought, you're authentic. I get it. Um, what was it like being on the set with Denzel back in your day, Wood? Well, that was just the dreamiest thing because, you know, I'm very inspired by Denzel Washington. And uh, I had some other instances where I was around him before that, but I didn't get to truly meet him. But I was in uh, the siege Mm -hmm. Very small role. I was in college at the time. I had just gotten out of college, and I got that role in the, in the film called The Siege. And um, so it was a bit role, nothing he would necessarily even remember me by. Right. And then I, I came to be in the final casting between me and one other actor for a film of his called Fallen. Uh, and the role went to the other actor, Gabriel Cassius. And so I met Denzel in the uh, callback situation. It was just me. Denzel and the director. And um, and the next time was about two years later, it was Remember the Titans. And so, uh, you know, I, I got a lot of love for Denzel Washington. I, I'm inspired by him and Lawrence Fishburne and Sidney Poitier and like the James Cagneys and Humphrey Bogarts and sure. all them cats. Do you, you have a good Denzel story from the set, from, a, from the movie, from um, the scene? There's a few good Denzel stories. I would say... Uh, well, one thing great about Denzel Washington, at least at that time, we shot Remember the Titans uh, in Atlanta, mm -hmm. in, in Georgia. And uh, when Denzel would come on the set, we'd be in a stadium, football stadium full of people. And you could hear people talking, ah, you know, just regular talk, yep. but it's loud. And literally, he could go on the field and be like, crowd would quiet up. and They'd first be, ah. you know, he could actually go <laughs> to like, a stadium and people know. would quiet yeah because Denzel would, Washington they, yeah he could he could he can make people follow you know and um what I really got out of him the most is because I'm always like kind of searching for what I can sponge from a person you mm -hmm. know so his professionality was really great for me to see um time on time and I just need to see that because as you know, I'm artistic so you know you might get in your own zone sometime and just mm -hmm. be sort of selfish or just alone in your thinking and not realizing I need to be more professional about things. So at that time, early on, I learned timeliness on the set, preparation. From him? Pretty much from him, yeah. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern, for free.